that solar powered car again. Another version. The idea on this one is we can set the steering so it goes round in circles. Eighty-eight percent done. Four hours thirty-six minutes. Right, that's ready. Hi guys, this worked absolutely fine, solar powered car, I'm now going to change it to one where I can turn the front wheels so we have steering so I can make it go round in circles. So I can swap the back wheels over with no trouble, front wheels I've got to modify or at least modify the hubs so we Got these little turny bits. I'll have a cross member across there. To mount the wheels on them, I'm actually going to bang a nail in that hole so that the wheels actually spin on the nail rather than having a axle going right the way across. So I'll modify those wheels to do that. Uh, the motor mount, we'll glue a new one on. The solar panel mount, we'll glue a new one on there because they're glued onto here so I can't get them off. Uh, so that's it. I'll get on and do it quickly because it's hot in here. Um, yeah, so I'll just get on with it. She tested this in advance so it might all go horribly wrong somewhere in here I had some nails of the right size all right so we want clearance hole through here this is two and a half millimeter drill bit we won't drill through our fingers Okay, that's one. Make sure we do the other one the other way round or we'll be a bit upset. Is this going to work? Yeah, we got a bit of clearance. I need to put a screw down through there.
piece of wire to link them together. Right, so there's our steering. Now I've deliberately limited it because if it goes too tight, then it adds too much friction to the turn. Oh, that's the phone ringing. But I may still adjust that so it can go a bit further than that. Right, next. We need back axle. Upside. Oh, out of focus. Oh dear, I'm sorry guys, I don't know how long that's been out of focus. I haven't been watching the camera. Still, this bit goes on here. Align it so it will mesh with the gear. Right. Okay, we have a turn. Well guys, we're out at Emerson's Green Skate Park. Beautiful blue sky. Oh, we have got some little white clouds. But more importantly, my solar car is going round in circles. Exactly what I designed it to do. That makes a change. So that's the solar car made from the solar panel and the motor from a fluttering butterfly garden ornament. It cost me two pound in Poundland and the rest of it's 3D printed. Oh, well, I've got three CDs there and one printed wheel. And from the looks of it, that's going to keep going until it eventually works its way over to the slope there where it will stop but as long as it's in sunlight that's just going to keep going I wonder if I can adjust the circle a bit so it's a bit wider Right, bigger circle. Using up more of the available space. Well, I'm going to call that a complete success. Sharp Eyed might notice the motor's got a little capacitor on it. As far as I can tell, that's absolutely no benefit whatsoever. There is a video in the playlist about it. I put it on there because I was asked. But I don't see any improvement in performance. 
The idea is it keeps running when it goes in a shadow. Uh, and the trouble is that was going downhill, so that's not a good demonstration. Oh, I made it go on the slope. Yeah, it's very difficult to tell whether the capacitor makes any difference. Oh, hill climbing. <laughs> I think we've taken enough time on this. I think we can establish it works and it works well. I'll just try and put it in shadow. Um, I don't know if there's enough shadow because, oh, there we go, stopped straight away. Yeah, I don't think that capacitor makes any difference whatsoever. And in the video on the subject, I also tried a supercapacitor with no benefit either. Point is, the capacitor doesn't get charged significantly because all the power is going to the motor. <laughs> Wheel spin. That'll do. Thanks for watching. If you want more information, check down below in the video description. If you like this video, you might like this one up here. And if you want to subscribe, you can check out my channel over here. Up here is my latest video on my channel, and down here is a video playlist associated with the video you've just watched. Thanks again for watching.